My name is Thor van Hees. I'm 22 years old, born and raised in Amsterdam, and uh, I study chemistry at the University of Amsterdam. If Amsterdam would be a chemical, I think it would be carbon. Like carbon is like the building block of life. So that's of course very important for a city to be uh, alive. It needs people, but uh, carbon also has the interesting property that it can be only like burned wood, so you can draw with it. So you can be really creative with carbon, but it can also be a diamond, very pretty and strong. We arrived at the Northern Market. I used to go here with my mom and also with my niece. So she's the same age as me. When we were like this high, we were like running around here and my mother was doing groceries for the rest of the week. And uh, haven't been here for a while, uh, only like half a year ago when I moved more into this area, I really made like a routine about like going here. And that's what I really like. So I guess I started to like this place more and more. It's a good friend of mine from high school and uh, yeah, it's really nice to see him each week because I go here every week to do my groceries and these days it's really difficult to keep in touch with each other with like all the spots around social media. It's nice to see each other face to face and although it's only like a small chit chat, it's still nice. For me, Amsterdam is the place where I live, where I study. I feel really comfortable here, but it's also a place that you can leave to travel somewhere else. And you can always go back here. It's actually a really small city. If you compare it to like all the other big cities of Europe, then Amsterdam is just like a neighborhood. Yeah, it was like the second day of Christmas. Uh, I was bored with my housemate and we were like walking around the city and then we suddenly saw this store and uh, we knocked on the window because we saw somebody and we were like interested. Oh, what's this, what's this? And then, uh, yeah, he opened the door and he invited us in and he said like, ah, I'm actually close, but uh, you look like some handsome guys. Let's uh, take a look at my uh, stuff. Yeah, it was really nice. He offered some coffee and then I bought um, very nice corduroy pants. <laughs> yeah, Tommy is a really nice and happy person and I think we really both share this passion about clothing and style. I don't think I'm a fashionista, but I really value to have nice clothing. I don't think it's very important to match every color like precisely, but uh, I do like to have clothing that fits nice and feels comfortable. The best thing about Amsterdam is that it's really accessible for bikes. It makes transportation so easy. I do everything on my bike. It's just like I cannot live without it. I really like studying at the University of Amsterdam because it gives you a lot of freedom uh, in doing your own research. They really like prepare you of, to be a good researcher. They don't really emphasize on like really learning things by heart. So I, I really like that, that they give you the freedom to get yourself interested in subjects that you like. Uh, the University of Amsterdam is uh, yeah, getting more orientated to like uh, students from the outside as well, so not only from the Netherlands, so they're offering their courses, well more of their courses also in English, so it becomes really accessible and that's uh, I think nice. Like in my master course I also have like uh, a, a girl from Greece, a, a guy from uh, Costa Rica and a girl from Germany. I guess like especially for like politics and uh, economics and um, social studies, humanities, they're really opening up the university to like the world.
I don't think Amsterdam itself is changing, it's me who's changing. I'm getting older, I get new experiences, I meet new people, I see new places, and that keeps changing, like the things I see and that I experience. You get to learn to know what the city life is, but you also feel uh, comfortable and not overwhelmed. Amsterdam is a really nice city, but sometimes you might get bored and then it's really nice to travel somewhere else. And maybe I wanted to study abroad or continue my studies abroad. And, uh, but I'm really certain that I will always come back here. <laughs>